How to create a progress circle chart in Google Sheets. Progress circle chart data requirements. You need one column of categorical data to create a progress circle chart. Categorical data definition. It describes a characteristic or a category of data. It takes on values that are names or labels. Categorical data is also called qualitative data. You need one column of numerical data to create a progress circle chart. Numerical data definition. It is in the form of numbers and is numeric in nature. It can be counted or measured and can be arranged in a logical order. Numerical data is also called quantitative data. In this video, we will construct a progress circle chart with two data columns as follows. One column containing categorical data. One column containing numerical data. Important, progress circle chart will only accept data in columns as shown in the image on the left. Click on the extensions menu. Install Chart Expo add-on, enhance your charting experience with advanced charts. An add-on is software that adds new features into Google Sheets. How to install Chart Expo video is available in iCard, located in top right corner. Video link is also provided in the description below, please click on more. Once the Chart Expo add-on is installed, it should display an extensions menu. Click on the Charts, Graphs and Visualizations by Chart Expo. Click on Open Sub-Menu. Click on the Add New Chart button. Search for Progress Circle Chart. Then select it. Select the sheet holding your data from Sheet Name drop-down. Note, header row checkbox is checked because data contains header row. Select metric progress. Select dimension project phase. You can set row range using the slider or manually set value in start row and end row text boxes. Currently, we will select all rows. When all required selections have been made, the Create Chart button will become active. Click on the Create Chart button. Progress Circle Chart is created successfully. Click on the Edit Chart button. Click on the Chart Header pen to edit the properties. Then enter the header text. Make sure you have turned on Show Property before you click the Apply button. Click on the Chart Settings button to change chart settings. Click on the Variation Type section. You can arrange the charts in two lines. You can reset arrangement of charts to default that is one line. Click on the chart settings button to change chart settings. Click on the variation type section. You can select any type of chart variation. Variation Type 2 Variation Type 3 Variation Type 4 Variation Type 5 Variation Type 6 You can reset the chart variation to default Type 1.
click on the Chart Data Point Properties pen to edit the properties. Click on the remaining color section to change the color. Click on the Center Label section. You can set the prefix and post fixto numbers. Click on the Font Style section. You can set the font style. You can reset the remaining color. Click on the Legend Properties pen to edit the properties. Click on the Legend section. You can show or hide legend. You can set the dock. You can set the legend alignment. Click on the box section. You can change the color. Click on the Save button. Click on the Export button to export chart in JPG, PNG, SVG, or PDF. Click on the Add Chart to Sheet button to add chart image in Sheet. We appreciate your business, thank you. Please remember to subscribe to our channel.